Once we know how to select rows based on Boolean conditions, it's actually quite simple to change values also based on Boolean conditions within a particular column. In the school's data frame, if we examine some of the columns, we realize that they have empty cells, not probably because the information isn't known, but rather because those columns should have zeros in them. For example, Native Hawaiian and other Pacific Islanders has many empty columns, and those are probably schools that don't have any students in that category present in them. However, if we load this school's data and examine those same columns, we can see that Pandas has filled them in with missing data indicators. What we really would like to do would be to replace these missing data values with zeros, because if we tried to carry out calculations on them, they wouldn't be accurate. We can use loc to specify a particular value by giving its row label index and its column label index. We see that in this particular cell, the value has an an. If we wanted to change just that one particular value, we can simply set that cell position equal to zero. And I see that has been done in the output result. Rather than assigning it to a particular cell one at a time, what we want to do is to select all the cells that meet a particular condition. Here we can create a Boolean series with the same number of values in it as the number of rows in the table, but whose values are either true or false based on whether the value in the Native Hawaiian or other Pacific Islander column is a null value or not. And that's going to look something like this. Changing the data then becomes quite simple. All we do is to assign values of zero in that particular location, but with the row values being specified as those that correspond to our selector series of true and false Boolean values. Now I can see that every row that previously had an NAN value now has zeros.